I don't know why I like this game, but I love it. Welcome to the Man Cave. Today's episode, we're going to look at the latest leak of Arcade 1-Up cabinets coming soon to a home near you. So, oh, it's the spiders. Forget it. Um, I'm excited about a few of these cabs, and one of them, you can see behind me, is Tron. And I'm already prepared to replace all of the hardware on it, in case it ever shows up, if it's real. So stay tuned, we're going to have a look, and remember to take a moment to like, comment, subscribe, put your notifications on, and remember, if you're not retro gaming, what are you doing? See you in a minute. A wise man once saying, all the world needs now is love. Sweet love. I think that was Burt Bacharach. Arcade 1UP seems to have changed that around to all the world needs now is more Street Fighter 2 cabinets. So, with the leak of Big Blue, the big Street Fighter 2 cabinet, because this is the old Arcade 1UP Street cabinet, actually playing the game that's meant for it for once. Um, do we need another Street Fighter 2 cabinet, the Big Blue cabinet? We've already got the Legacy, uh, Capcom Legacy Edition. We've already got the head-to-head uh, -head Street Fighter. We've already got the original Street Fighter 2. Do I really need another one? I guess that's up to you. If you like the look of that taller, big blue cabinet, then yeah, maybe all the world needs now is sweet Street Fighter II cabinets. Is it gonna be Wi-Fi enabled? We don't know. Looks like it might be, so you can play head-to-head -head against other people in, that have the same cabinet. That might be, a great, uh, might be a great feature for you guys to just, you know, go, yeah, I'm gonna, that's the one I want. That's the one I go for. How many Street Fighter <laughs> 2 versions are we gonna get with this one? Nobody knows, nobody knows. It could be two, it could be three, it could be what's uh, found on the original cabinet, or it could be a lot more than that. So I guess we're gonna have to wait for E3 to find out on that one. So another cabinet Arcade 1UP fans have been clamoring for is the Simpsons four-player cabinet. Now personally, if this is real, I think it should have come out with the, uh, the X-Men. Uh, cabinet, or at least the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles cabinet, but I mean, maybe you really want your own Simpsons cabinet. I personally find the gameplay it's a little repetitive. Uh, same with X Men too. I, I prefer the X Men, perhaps over the Simpsons. But at least uh, when it does come out, I already have my GRS um, replacement donut, so that's going to be fantastic. I'm glad Glenn's making these already. It's going to make that game a hell of a lot better. Boom! All right. So, want this cabinet? Is it Wi-Fi enabled? The leak seems to suggest it is. That means you're going to be able to play four players with your friends who spend the money and get the other four-player uh, Simpsons cabinet. What games are going to be on this thing? Well, it's rumored to have Simpsons bowling, as you can see with the trackball. No, not here, obviously, but in the picture I'm going to probably put up in post. Um, so you got Simpsons bowling. You've got uh, you've got the Simpsons arcade game. Maybe you've got the Simpsons wrestling game on there. Who knows what's going to be licensed and all that jazz that it takes to do that. So if you want the Simpsons, it might be on its way. You might be pretty excited about that. So the one cabinet I've been waiting for since Arcade 1UP announced they were making cabinets is my own Tron cabinet. As you can tell, it's not a Tron cabinet. To play Tron properly, you need this. You need the joystick that has the fire button on it. This is courtesy of Glenn's Retro Show GRS. Uh, you also need a spinner. Uh, the way I'm playing it on my uh, on my main machine here is I've got my fire button, this is my movement, and this rotates the hands. And it is not, it's not the greatest way to play it, so I'd really rather play it authentically. Now some people love Tron, some people hate Tron, some people are in the middle. Uh, I'm one of those who happen to love it. I spent a lot of time playing it. I didn't even really care for the movie back in 1982, I want to say. Uh, but I did play the arcade game a lot. Uh, so, out of all the cabinets that are coming out, I'd have to say that uh, the Tron cabinet is definitely the one I would spend my money on. According to the leak, it comes with two games. It comes with Discs of Tron, and it comes with Tron. Now, Tron is a vertical cabinet. This is uh, not a vertical cabinet, a uh, vertical screen. And Discs of Tron is a horizontal. Uh, arcade 1UP seems to have no issues jamming one into the other. Um, so that's an unfortunate thing. It would have been nice. I mean, it's great to have those two games in one, but one of them is going to suffer. And I'm assuming it's going to be the discs of Tron that's going to be sandwiched in um, 
because that's probably the second tier game, at least in arcade one-up sides. Um, if you remember, if you were back in the days of the arcade, you went into that arcade and you actually went in to that Discs of Tron arcade cabinet where you would walk right in. That was pretty cool. That was a pretty cool arcade cabinet that you could walk right into and play and you just felt enveloped into that. Uh, of course, I don't imagine that's coming, but I've been wrong before. They've got the sit-down outrun cabinets and they might have, who knows, a walk-in Tron Discs of Tron cabinet. I highly doubt it, but I bet you guys would probably mod that and have it, uh, have it their way. So is the Tron cabinet real? I'm going to go, yeah. I'm going to say, yeah, it is. And that's just purely speculation. Um, but I think people have been clamoring it for enough. If you go on Facebook, if you go on the other websites, you're going to see people, uh, what cabinet do you want? Tron, 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 Tron. Well, Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong. That's never going to happen. Tron, 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 Tron. Possibly could happen, and I think it has happened. I'm standing here with the Namco Giant Joystick, uh, released in the winter of 2020-2021. Uh, thank you very much for joining me today. And I have one question. Uh, since the, uh, the leak of the Baby Cade uh, from Arcade 1UP, that's the uh, smaller arcade 1UP uh, cabinets built for babies and toddlers, I wonder if you could answer a question for me, and how does it feel to no longer be the most ridiculous thing Arcade 1UP has released thus far? I will take that as a no comment. Back to you in the studio. I, why can't I remember? I wrote this stuff. Why can't I remember it? Hey, welcome to the man cave. Look what I'm playing. And look what possibly... Hey, welcome to the man cave. On today's episode, we're going to look at the latest leak of a car... 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 car, car, car. You, Tron, you... I don't know why I like this game, but I love it. Welcome to the, whatever it's called, the man cave. That's what it is. 